Hello and welcome. I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. This is episode 97 of Let's Play the Prince and the Thane mod for Crusader Kings 2. Or rather, let's give away all of our money to the filthy infidels for Crusader Kings 2. Uh, where we left off last, I still had a ton of wars going. A couple of them are positive, and we'll have some time to work on them. But 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12... 12 wars at negative 90% right now. Excellent. Couple of them. Maybe, maybe, maybe one more. One of those 12 will not end in surrendering. Okay, that's somebody that just fell. We should be able to get 100% out of somebody. There he is. You, little bastard. Surrender. Good job, Holy Order. They did a good job. This Holy Order, like, single-handedly won two of the wars. Why are you not beneath me? That's annoying. Okay, let's find another Englishman. God, these, these two, for instance, to be so easy. Ugh, so easy to beat them if I could just have gotten my army there in time. This guy, too. This guy right here. Look at that little flag. It's that little white thing with the red. This guy... Okay, good. We're, we'll be able to get him. So we've got time for that one. Really what I need to do is just hunt down armies. Like this guy. Can we, can we hunt your army down? Are you one of the people I'm actually at, at war with? Directly? Doesn't look like it. Let's just assault this one. I want this done. So yeah, one way to make the game more challenging is to just to declare war on 30 people at once. <laughs> not always the best strategy, <laughs> but it's, some not, it's an option. Alright, what do we want to do with this army? I don't think this is going to happen, but um, let's give it a shot. I think this one we'll be okay with as soon as we... Just, I'm going to send these guys here. I want to make sure we actually win this this battle. For sure. I think we're going to lose it. Yep, we were. We, we did. Okay, that was another siege event. Do we get somebody important? No, that was here. This guy's being a jerk. Not enough men to siege that one. Ooh, that guy. Negative 95%. If we can get if we can catch his army, then I can actually still I can still turn that one. Ooh, there goes my holy order. Unless I can win. Knights! Come on, knights! Ah, boo. Hey, somebody surrenders. Excellent. I don't know who that was. Probably who, what, now? This guy. Good, 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 good. He finally gave up. That is good. Now, keep in mind, even if I have to go, like, negative 20,000 gold in the hole, I have some, some tricks up my sleeve. You'd be surprised at what I can do. And I'm not too worried about it, honestly. Because, you know, let, like, let's say we, do, you know, we declared 30 wars and we've won... I don't know, probably 10 to 15 of them so far, and we're, gonna, we're still going to win another number of them. The realm has still grown. And remember, you don't play this game on a per-character basis. Like, it's, it's a 400-year game, and this is just going to be known as the Great Depression of Great Britain. <laughs> we have no money, but we still... Uh, let's go there. Okay, we're down to... Ugh. Yep, we're going to lose a bunch of them. But not from him. Let's 
soon as we get to 100%, we're going to get a lot of people forcing the forcing the title. Yep, there we go. There's one. You accept my offer of peace. Oh, thanks. I don't remember offering. Ugh. Okay, you have what? You want white peace. I will accept white peace from you. Prestige, just as... Yeah, look at all these wars. Ugh. Oh god, here it comes. It's going to hit us. It's going to hit us like a ton of bricks. Now we've got negative opinion because of raised levies, because of high crown authority, because of some trait problems. Lack of funds is minus 20. Yep. Let's make sure we have the release to prisoner bonus. We're going to need that. That'll help out slightly. We have no money to give away. I probably should have given... No. We would have just gone further in the hole. That's interesting. Ah! <laughs> Look at this. You can't go below negative 999 gold. <laughs> I didn't know that. That's awesome. Look at this. Watch. Every time I gain some gold and then I go back to 999, even though I should be at like negative 20,000. Ah! That's awesome. That is funny. Alright. What do you want? You live where? There? No. No white peace. We're taking your land, buddy. We'll break off a detachment. And we'll go attack you. And we're going to sit on these two, and we'll win those. This guy. Let's see if we can go take care of that. Look at that. 1,000. That's all you can have there. Yikes. Okay, here's, here comes another guy taking three gold. I'm going to make him... I'll wait till he forces it, though. That is funny. <laughs> so it wasn't nearly as bad as I thought it would be. Now we still have, you know, some serious vassal uh, opinion problems right now. So let's take care of some of that with decisions. We'll give you a really good title, like... Uh, here you go, you can be that guy. And the next lowest duke now, you can be the keeper of that, whatever. This guy's just a mare, but we'll make him a sir. You can be a master horse. Sounds good. Factions. Still mostly loyal. We do have some people in the independence thing, so we've got to keep it together. Look at this. 24,000 prestige, 9,000 piety, and people are wanting to declare independence. You ungrateful bastards. Don't you understand? Sure, Alan, you can become a squire. My coffers are empty, but my but the coffer my vassals are full. They have an obligation to their liege. Ask for 250 gold. This little guy here will like me less. Yes. Give me your money. Refused. You little bastard. Should execute him. Become a scholar. Okay. You know, we have, like, no men. Oh, dear. Okay, well, you guys can slowly work your way over here. No, go this way. So we really only have, what, five wars, four of which are actually mine. One with this guy who we're, we're good on. One with that guy we're good on. 
one with that guy that we're good on, and then one with this guy. So you guys are going to have to go, yeah, to there. He's actually got an army. So we'll need to get something over there relatively quick. There are two peasant families in Bashkirs who have been locked in a bitter feud for generations. This conflict has now escalated to the point where it is even discussed in circles of nobility. Although this feud would normally be far beneath your notice, this could be a golden opportunity to practice your diplomacy. Sure. We're going to need it. Um, you want to educate who now? My daughter? Sure. Did my best. I tried. We fulfilled the ambition to improve diplomacy. Now would be the time, I think, to start the Byzantine throne ambition. Ooh, excuse me. That was like a half sneeze. Almost totally prevented it, but not quite. This is going to fall pretty quick because I think it fell earlier. Hey, the Pope gave me some money. That's nice of you. Appreciate that. If we could just get positive again, we'd have a huge boost to opinion, like right away. Also, morale of armies is suffering from being negative. Hugely, hugely suffering from being negative. Okay, no. Oh, shit. I'm cynical. I can't afford any money right now. I can't spend money on anything. Whew. Okay, that's nice. Wow, you've raised another little army? You can break off probably 3,000. No, we can, we can really only break off about 2,000 of these. now what? No white piece. Never give up, never surrender, except for when they force you to. Okay, come on. No, don't lose. What do you want? No. Crap. River crossing penalty. Hey, we siege something. Excellent. 100%. Thank you. That one's looking good. What you guys had there? Eventually that one will fall. Losing that battle doesn't help, really. But as soon as this falls, this guy will be done. There we go. See how close I was on some of these? I, ugh. If we had just gotten there six months earlier, we would have been totally fine on every war that I declared. But no. Factions. Yeah, only a very small number are actually still supporting independence. We're fine. We don't need money. Oh, he's actually got more men. How did you suddenly have more men than that? That's annoying. Let's re go around and rejoin then. What? These guys actually lost? Or did I click them off? I may have clicked them off. Okay, and the actual war target is not this one, but this one. So let's head there everybody. And I'm going to need to take back whatever he conquests here.
Yay, Alan is learning how to use swords. This isn't my war, so I don't really care about it. But apparently it's going well. We're down to just two. Can we take that army? Probably. Let's give it a shot. Although we're negative. That's, that's why we lost. I'm dumb, obviously. I have no morale. We should have won, but we have no morale. We need to avoid avoid combat for right now. Let's just have them head down there and take the capital. And that will win that war. Meanwhile, this one's about to fall. White piece? No. You know your your thing's about to fall, so you're gonna die. Gonna lose all your land right here, right here, right here, right here, right here, right here. Man, this this woman, look at this this woman is popping out kids like nobody's business. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and she's on her ninth at 33. Either she or I or both of us know how to make kids. You know what? I'm going to try to ransom back his brats to him first. Because once I win, he won't really be... That's why there's all these people in here who are only worth 10 gold. Don't care. Don't care. Oh, you're that Catholic. Don't care. Don't care. Do you don't have any money. Get out of here. Don't care. None of them have any money, be or they're, they're only worth 10 gold because I captured them right before forcing the peace and then displaced them from their positions, and so no one's willing to pay money for somebody that's not landed. And then there was one. And we're only at negative 300 gold now. All right, I'm going to wrap this one up here. In the next video, we will um, wrap up our last war. And then probably declare wars on everyone again. Because they're bastards and I want their land. So thanks so much for watching. See you soon.